Hi everyone. Hope you all are doing well. We all know with the increase in the crude oil prices, inflation also increases. And to meet the fossil fuel requirement of country, India imports 79% of its fossil fuel. But the important thing is that these fossil fuels are available in limited quantity and are not a clean source of energy. Moreover, disposal of municipal solid waste is also one of the major challenge in India and this is due to the improper segregation of waste at its source of generation according to one estimate 80 to 90% of municipal solid waste ends up into the landfills and landfills have numerous environmental and public health issues the food waste in dumping sites releases methane gas into the atmosphere which is a strong greenhouse gas the leachates from the landfill contaminates the groundwater resources and the odor and the other noxious gases also affects the health of the people and the cattle living in the nearby area. Hence, to support the sustainable development and Atmanirbhar strategy, Indore Municipal Corporation has come up with an idea of eco-friendly technology with win-win situation by developing the Asia's largest bio-CNG plant at the cleanest city of India, Indore. This plant is also known as the Gobar Dhan. Success of this project is predicted due to the 100% segregation of waste at the source of its generation and thanks to every citizen of Indore for segregating the dry and wet waste at their houses and making this project a success. This bio CNG plant is spread over 15 acres of area and is built with Rs 150 crores of investment. This plant is capable of treating 550 tons of organic municipal solid waste per day with production of 17,000 kilograms of CNG and 100 tons of organic compost per day with reduction of 1,30,000 kilograms of carbon emission. Means this is zero process waste plant. The Indore Municipal Corporation will buy half of the bio CNG produced to run 400 buses and half of the bio CNG will be sold in the open market at the cheaper rate. Process of bio CNG generation All the segregated municipal solid waste is collected from all the collection centers of Indore and is first added into the deep bunker from where it is transferred into the grape grinder which converts the organic waste into quality feed and this is a primary treatment. The waste is then transferred into the anaerobic digester where microbes break down the organic matters like food, crop residue, wastewater etc. to produce the biogas. The generated biogas is consisting of 55-60% to 60 of methane and to convert this biogas into CNG we need to take the methane concentration up to 90% and more. And this is done in the cleaning section where biogas is upgraded and impurities are removed. Then purified bio CNG gas is stored into the cylinder from where it is distributed for use. Whereas the slurry of the digester is transferred into solid liquid separator to generate the organic manure. This campaign will go a long way in making Indian cities clean, pollution free and in the direction of clean energy. Thank you. Knowledge is power to your success.